Hey, I'm uh, Robert Pattinson. I'm Zoe Kravitz, and we're from the movie The Batman, and we're and gonna do this BuzzFeed co-star co test. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> and I'm, I'm trying to tell a joke, and then someone writes it down, and then it looks like I'm saying it seriously, and they're like, he's lying. And I'm like... I think you like to do, like, your... I don't, I mean, you're you're, a story. The joke, it is once, a joke, it is a joke. Once you tell a story a bunch of times, you have to add little, little bits and pieces to it, and eventually it starts to get out of control. It's, it's all like <laughs> You need some flavor, you need some flavor. So this is a one-way sweat streak that Robert... Correct. Right, okay. Yeah. Have you apologized subsequently for that? You know what? Yeah, I was up and you even got pe but you were upset. I wasn't upset. I actually had Literally. to I, I, I was like, there's well, nothing I can do. No, while it was you, happening, I was like just lay there and take it. I was like, there are lots of girls who would like to have just try and <laughs> try and try and be happy about the sweat. I don't know. And I don't gross. know if that's really true. This is true. gross. This is <laughs> that's gross. Not really true. Getting your eyeball. I heard there was a little bit of sweat during that scene. Yep, lots of sweat. That was Zoe. Yeah, that was me. It was only. She had to take her little hat off yeah, and squeeze it out gross. afterwards. You're still getting used to the cow, too. I was like, too. you're going to have to get some deodorant. Oh, my God. <laughs> no, he was he sweat in my mouth. <laughs> First day, day one, sweat in mouth. <laughs> so that's a good way to start the relation between two inches. Yeah, very good start. Yeah. And really, this is clearly, it's done, it's done wonders. I'm so to sweat. How? Yeah, why don't you just, oh, 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 it's right in my... So look at a lot of the forum stuff, and it actually really did inform my character a lot. Ooh. Wow. Still look at it nowadays. I uh, uh, generally look, sometimes I just get pushed a little far, and I have to respond to something. <laughs> so when sometimes you just see a quite abstract message going like, just please, just leave me alone. That's rough. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> Stop picking faults. <laughs> I'm doing my best. I'm doing my best. That's Rob. Yes. Well, it's obviously. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Well, ha, that show still holds up too. Zoe, who's yours? Rob has. Rob's my Batman. It's gotta my be. Batman. Yeah. It's gotta be. Will you be my Batman? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like Valentine. Yes, you Say yes. Oh, yes. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> If these two, uh, Selena and Bruce, ran into each other on the street, wearing street clothes, daytime, would there be a spark between them? Or is it the intrigue in the, the costumes that really gets them? I don't think it's the costumes that get them, but I do think that it, it, it kind of, um, it's like a shortcut to seeing what, you know, what the person's really like on the inside. But I would like to think that if, if Bruce and Selena met somewhere and were able to spend a few minutes alone together, that there would be a connection regardless. Mm. I always like the fact that like you just very casually take off your mask and all our scenes together, then I just and you never question you never Well yeah. Well because I'm because it's you know, she's not Catwoman, I think it's more of like a practical thing for her in terms of riding the bike or, or breaking into someone's safe or something. Yeah. I think she feels I mean you already know what I look like. You know you've seen me at work. That's true. Yeah. Doesn't I've make been any your sense. You've been to my house. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. You don't know me. Uh, I mean I'm very I'm scared of flying. I don't know how that how rash is very scared of flying. He's been on a plane with me now and he sees it's, it's, very, strange. I'm very scared. It's very scary. It's very vulnerable. Mm. But um, you will go on a train under the sea. Which I know, kind of, it doesn't is... really, well, like, so it's irrational, uh, I don't yeah, know. Yeah, that seems a lot scary. The Batman himself is Robert Pattinson. <laughs> so before we introduce our film... As soon as, as, soon as I got the call, yeah. and, uh, I don't need a script. I don't read scripts anyway. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Still haven't read it. it doesn't matter, still haven't read it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, literally, do you want to play Batman? Yeah, sure. That sounds right. Whatever. Um, <laughs> Whatever, shut up! <laughs> Don't um, call me again! <laughs> How'd you get this number? You get this? <laughs> Who are you? Sorry, we're sorry. No, not at all. <laughs> yeah. So, did you... No. <laughs> no, that's a lie. <laughs> Thank you. Did I what? Did I what? Did I what? Um... Did... Was the bat in the cage? The cat, the bat in the cage was real. 
<laughs> Is that the question? I thought this was a statement. Oh. Um, and okay. I thought it was a truth and a lie, but maybe. Oh, not. truth and a lie. God. That is. Did I? I I rode the motorcycle the whole time. That was always me riding the motorcycle. Thank yes. you so much. Okay, so the that bat. That is the truth. The bat. <laughs> the bat was real. The bat was real. No. Oh. Oh, that's two lies. <laughs> see? Sorry. Do you see? It's out of control. <laughs> I gotta tell the difference. <laughs> I was really impressed by Rob's ability to make each scene feel different than another scene because because his face is so covered up and you can only see, you know, basically chin and jaw and eyes, it's really hard to, I would imagine it, was, it would be really hard to kind of give any musicality and um, and to be able to have the audience feel the difference in, in tone and emotion and um, watching him do that basically with only his eyes and, and even his eyes are, are quite hard to see because it's all you know dark around them. So watching him actually figure out how to do that was incredible. Thanks. You're welcome. Uh -huh. I think as soon, I mean, it, it, as soon as I came in when we were doing a screen test together, it was very, I mean, it's it's just great when you see someone who's just really perfect for a part, and she just came and it was like, and even though you, were, I mean, I would imagine you'd be kind of, kind of nervous, I was totally nervous, and she like didn't look nervous at all. She was kind of improvising and stuff, and I was like, whoa, this is like, <laughs> and I was just kind of standing like, um, can you just say the lines? <laughs> I know, sorry, I remember <laughs> like, that moment. I don't know how to improvise <laughs> like this. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Why are you going off book? Don't go off Don't go off again. book. It's embarrassing. <laughs> so That's really funny. And your chemistry with Rob, what was that like? Oh, he's one, I mean, he's a wonderful actor and he's someone who I've known for a long time, but I was really in awe of his ability to completely disappear into this character. I, I would forget that it was him sometimes, which was amazing. I mean, it's like the same thing with any, I mean, I'm someone who likes to hold grudges. And, you really and do. I feel like I get a lot of fuel out of it. I mean, like probably 80% of my life is to really just stick it you to somebody really else. Do. We're gonna <laughs> so, talk about this later. And and uh, and so I think there it, there are definite uh, kind of benefits. There's definite positive. Full birthday. What's your birthday? <laughs> <laughs> okay, Rob's birthday is in. It's in May. <laughs> Half a point. <laughs> when's my birthday? I think you're a Capricorn, no? No! Uh, Sagittarius? Yes. I don't know when Sagittarius <laughs> is. <laughs> it's like at the end of the year, you seem like a kind of Christmas Christmas day. What am I, Jesus? As a Christmas child. I would okay, say, I say both... January, no, like, no, towards the end, like 28th of December or something like that? Maybe mm. a couple, beginning of January? Mm. It's the opposite of what you're saying. You said beginning end of End of January. Beginning of December. Yes! yes. <laughs> One point for me. Okay, no, okay, so I think we know the same amount. I know that your birthday's in May. You know that my birthday is sometime in December. Yeah, and it was sort of towards the end. Everyone thought I was making this up, it's true. Oh, the it's chicken true. and the, and the, and yeah. the butthole thing? <laughs> the butthole thing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so the audience, Matt, I wanted to ask you, what it was that drew you to this project and why you wanted to tackle Batman? I mean, I've been a fan of Batman since I was a kid. Batman 1966, Adam West, that was my Batman. And I just have loved the character my whole life. And I feel like this particular character is such an amazing character in that the world is such an exciting and rich world with so many rich characters got to work with these incredible actors here. And, and do a version I feel like you've never seen before. So we're super excited to share it with you. Did it, a lot of the movie was shot here in the, in the UK. What were some of your favorite locations? And being in London, shooting Central London, but being in Liverpool and being in... We spent kind of a lot, but it's not but like But like, think about like the, the technology and stuff, like that's probably... Yeah, I mean, maybe expensive, that. Expensive, right? Yeah, yeah, it's probably quite expensive. I mean, but I don't think it's like a hundred million. <laughs> I think okay. he's been a bit like I mean yeah it's, it's like, like it's not like it's a it's also the car is like a muscle car it's yeah and like he's built yeah. it himself and so it's kind of like you know you could can, I think that's what always has been the appeal of somewhat in Batman that like you know if you had the cash you could theoretically be Batman kind of um and I guess in this one you like you don't even need that much cash <laughs> you just need a little bit you need a little bit and a little bit of expertise maybe some like YouTube tutorials on how to like build stuff
Uh, it's also, I think, like the the money's buying you the the luxury of being able to like focus on on this versus yeah, like yeah, exactly. He doesn't yeah. have to have a job. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. It's <laughs> <That's> pretty. <laughs> it's a big Action. Difference. Is there anything for you, Rob? Aging. Yeah, de death. <laughs> just death, death in just... general. The, uh, the abyss. <laughs> uh, no, way, but actually, it's like... yeah. Mm, um, you scared of spiders? I'm not really scared Snakes? of spiders so much. No. Clowns. Not really clowns you, either. You said earlier like, that you were afraid of clowns. People thinking that when you're wearing shoes and your feet look really big. <laughs> But, I have that. I don't yeah, talk about but then that. no one else. Everyone's like, they look totally normal size. I'm like, no. That's your. <laughs> that square was something that was just magical experience. We uh, we we just didn't believe that we were making a movie in Liverpool. Judgment. Judgment. <laughs> Answer the question so quick that I'm literally just like. Oh, I'm oh, sorry. Wait, wait. Okay, wait. Let me. Judgment. <laughs> Really thought about that. Well, it's very, I know the well, answer. The only answer I can think of, I just, I just end up agreeing with you. Obviously. Yes, okay. yes, judgment. I like I like someone who applauds, who applauds. Just what, you want a yes person? No, literal applause. You want a literal, <laughs> you want a literal <laughs> phrase and applause, I got it. I like a lot of got phrase. It. A compliment machine. Yeah, someone <laughs> to tell you that you're pretty yeah. great. <laughs> All right, well, Batman is flying back into theaters. Go watch The Batman at Cinemark. You can get your tickets at cinemark.com. Who are you under there? What are you hiding? Selena, don't throw your life away. Don't worry, honey. I got nine of them. What did you guys learn about each other during this whole experience? Extremely hard worker. Uh... Kind of. I mean, I only really hung out with Zoe socially, so I just thought she was just a party. Oh girl. my god! <laughs> no, I didn't really. <laughs> no, I always thought she was a great actress, but um, but like you know, there, on on a movie, like, it was really relentless work schedule, and kind of uh, you know, it could have been awful if you had someone who was just couldn't you know didn't want to put the effort in, but Zoe really brings a hundred and fifty percent. Dressing room must have. Mm, I actually know what because I actually went in your dressing room. What? Times without you realizing, you used to use your toilet because mine didn't work. Where? No, you didn't. That's not true. You have little candles. Yeah, I have candles. How else did I know? No, I walked in by accident once. <laughs> Coca Cola. No. No? I don't really have any must-haves. I've never even in the dressing room, ever. Oh, mm. no. I don't know him. Okay, you get that one, too. I do have him. Um. Uh, and you're just pouring sweat the whole time. And when I put on this one, you could just move so much. I remember the first thing I did. I started doing, um, I started doing roly-poly. What? <laughs> that was the first thing I did in it. Is that when you roll around and on I your... somersault. Oh, but, uh, that's cute. Actually, I think in American, a roly-poly is something different. Cartwheel? A cartwheel. cartwheel. That's what it's called. You did a, uh, you did a cartwheel? Wait, is a cartwheel with the hands? No, yeah, when you, no, like, no, no, yeah, like a forward roll. Okay, you, you rolled. You did a roll. <laughs> Rolly pulley. Rolly pulley. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then they, I kept adding that into all the fight scenes. Okay, I'm picturing you just rolling around. And like, you can do it like one or two times and it's fine, but like if you do it like 10 times a row, even that, it's, it's kind okay, of painful. Okay, I'm sorry, I'll never forget the visual of you doing it. Also, <laughs> you made it sound a lot cooler than it. Yeah, <laughs> it was. You like bend your uh, ear after a while. So. Oh, buddy. <laughs>